Hello, good morning and welcome to TAB. This is a webinar about fractional ownership and the title is Fractional Property Ownership. Isn't it about time we caught up with other asset classes? I'm Duncan Krieger. I'm the founder and CEO of TAB. Let's go. So today's seminar. Firstly, let me tell you a bit about TAB. TAB helps to stimulate the property market in two ways. Number one, by providing bridging loans and development finance to borrowers who need access to short-term capital quickly. And number two, by enabling investors to access the UK property market via funding bridging loans and through fractional property ownership. So fractional property ownership, isn't it about time we caught up with other asset classes? The purpose of this seminar is to introduce to you all property investors a revolutionary way to buy sell and own property we'll be going through some of the following things later in this presentation what is fractional property ownership and what currently exists what is fractional property ownership is exactly what i just said before how much could you earn fractional property ownership examples how does fractional property ownership earn you a passive income and the differences between fractional property ownership and real property investment. Finally, we'll be talking about how you can invest in fractional ownership um, via TAB or others. TAB was founded in early 2018 when I identified the need um, for property projects that didn't fit within the constraints of traditional lending businesses. At TAB, we are best in class. Our team is best in class and we're extremely proud of that. So as mentioned before, I'm Duncan Krieger. Um, I've overseen more than two and a half billion pounds worth of new loans in my career, and I managed a loan book from zero to nearly half a billion pounds at my previous firm. At TAB, we have a host of in-house property lawyers, quality underwriters, very high level salespeople, and lots of others who make up an experienced team. And again, one that I'm extremely proud of. TAB's launched revolutionary fractional ownership. So we are launched and available in the market. Fractional property ownership is where multiple investors can purchase a share of a property and receive a portion of that rental income. Splitting ownership across multiple properties makes sense for a number of reasons and we'll go into detail about that later on. TAB also funds loans via its network of private investors. And as you can see over on the right hand side, um, 72 million, almost 100 million since we started a couple of years ago, and over three million pounds paid in interest to our investors since we started. We are on the way to getting the fractional ownership business off the ground and already nearly touching a million pounds on that side. And we've reduced the minimum investment that one can make into these investments to just a thousand pounds. So just to finish off on the left hand side, we deliver a bespoke finance um, extremely quickly. It is not uncommon for us to turn loans around in less than a week. Um, and we really do value keeping things simple. Tab's all about trust and transparency and keeping things simple is at the heart of that. OK, so we're going to talk some more about fractional ownership investments and a little bit about the market overview. So fractional ownership is a method in which several unrelated parties can own a share of a usually high value tangible asset. So investors can spread and mitigate the risk by taking just a small portion of each investment. Smaller minimum investments enable a wider group of investors to participate and have ownership in multiple assets. Investors are no longer constrained by their capital. Existing fractional ownership investments include cars, whiskey, wine, art, gold, and even private jets. Forbes in a recent article identified this ownership model as an area to watch as it echoes other streams in the emerging modern sharing economy. Knight Frank Luxury Investment Index indicates the 10 year performance of asset classes that you can own fractional investments have risen, proving that there is a huge appetite for this alternative investment. And the 10 year performance of property is up 41%. Okay, so what exactly is fractional property ownership? 
So now there's a way to access investment properties, income producing investment properties, paying a monthly rental income and benef benefiting from capital growth as well. Fractional property ownership is an opportunity to invest in real estate and share the risk along with the upside and rental income and obviously potential capital growth. By investing in a share of an asset, you can access the property market with a lower upfront stake and increased portfolio diversification. You, along with other investors, purchase a share of the property and what we're looking for is long-term sustainable income. Owning a share gives you the right to earn your share of that property's income. With fractional property ownership, Tab does all the hard work so you don't have to. We sort out the tenants and we sort out estate agents, legal fees and property management all handled under one roof. We're going to talk a little bit about the earning potential of doing an investment like this. So this isn't a get rich quick scheme. This isn't something that we expect to be able to double your money overnight. There are lots of other things that entice people in to do that. What Tab's focused around is bricks and mortar and investing in real estate that produces income. So if you have a look on the table that we've provided in this presentation, a thousand pound investment um, would give you £58.50 a year, 5.85%. Over two years, another £58.50 and it's the same again for year three. The overall return includes capital growth that may be achieved when selling that property at a later stage. So for illustration purposes, we've used a three year turnaround time, which is currently what TAB is offering on its fractional ownership investments. And in total, you would expect to receive £1,265.50 from your original £1,000 investment. We'd be happy to go into this in more detail. Um, but this is to show that you can receive a monthly income. So your share of the £58.50 paid every month and at the end, um, an additional capital increase when the property is sold. Uh, one thing I will quickly remind you, um, which is extremely important, is that your capital is at risk. Property is not a guaranteed winner. Property goes up as well as it goes down. Over long periods of time, You'll, you, over long periods of time throughout history, you'll see that property has continued to go up in value, but there are always snapshots in time where property can be less worth slightly less than you paid for it. Um, and it's important to understand any investments that you look at. Um, so I just wanted to draw your attention to that. So let's talk through an example. And what we try to do is make buying a property like this one displayed here much easier um, and less capital intensive than it would otherwise be. The first thing I would say is that if you were to embark on buying this property yourself, there would be a whole host of upfront fees that aren't detailed necessarily on this list. Some are, some aren't. Um, but when you're investing in a property this way, then all of those costs are amalgamated together to combine a total purchase price. And in this case, we're looking at a purchase price of £415,000. There is a listing fee, which is TABS fees for arranging, sourcing and arranging this investment. Stamp duty um, is an unavoidable tax when purchasing any property. And although there's been stamp duty holiday, holidays and lots of good reasons to invest in the property market, it, you, one must remember that that is specifically for your main residence. When you're buying an investment property, um, there is currently a 3% surcharge. Legal fees um, are unavoidable, although the idea of the TAB fractional ownership platform is that it wouldn't be as legal fee intensive to transfer in and out um, in the future. Valuation fees, quite important. And also what we call the kitty, which is a maintenance pot for every property. When we purchase a property like this, we kick off with a small cash reserve, meaning that any repairs or maintenance that would need to be carried out on the property, we won't need to come back to you in order to raise that money. So you can see here that the total purchase price, having agreed a £415,000 purchase, um, the total to purchase this property is £442,000. 
the gross rent payable on that um, property is just over £30,000 a year. And TAB charges a 10% management fee in this case. Although keep an eye on these as they come up because there will be slight changes um, to the management fees. But everything, as I said, from TAB is um, as transparent as we possibly can be. So in this case, it's a 10% annual management fee. And that is deducted from the rental income before distribution. And every year from that £30,000 worth of rent, uh, just over £1,500 will be added to the kitty each year. Again, making sure that this property is in a position where it can continue to produce rental income for the foreseeable future. This property actually has a 15 year lease, um, so the income is pretty secure and we think that's one of the key elements to what TAB's offering to the market. What that's showing you in the bottom left hand corner is that the net rent available to distribute to investors is just under £26,000, 25876 and as a percentage of the £442,000 total purchase price, that is where we get to the 5.85% per annum. So fractional property ownership and passive income. Passive income is when you earn money from a rental property or when you earn money at all um, without having to be actively involved. It's where you can make your money work for you and you can receive a monthly income. Through tab property fractional ownership, we ensure that management fees and contributions towards the kitty are taken into account before calculating your return. So with TAB property, you can benefit from the UK property market. You can invest from just a thousand pounds. You let TAB deal with all of the management and we resolve any maintenance issues without having to um, interfere with your day-to-day -day life. You sit back and watch the money roll in. That's the idea. Okay, I'm gonna to talk to you a little bit about the difference between owning property directly or owning property via fractional ownership model. So obviously via fractional ownership, you own a portion of that property. With a buy to let investment, you typically own that property either outright or with a mortgage. Monthly rental income should come in on both, although you will have some expenses to pay on the um, standard buy to let model. Capital growth should be um, an opportunity on both sides. Um, with fractional ownership, you have no tenant management at all, no estate agents. Um, and if you own a buy to let, you're likely to have at least an agent um, reporting to you with tenant management issues and long legal processes with regard to um, estate agents, collections and that sort of thing. Um, so really passive income is what we're looking for in the fractional ownership model and what you don't need, um, which I think is the real big one from my point of view, is to have a huge deposit and then match that with a lot of personal debt. So a mortgage is one way currently or the only way currently to buy a property unless you want to lay out £442,000 of your own money. Um, but this fractional ownership model is starting to pave the way for there being an alternative to borrowing from the banks. And with a fractional property ownership model, you can diversify your portfolio to um, a much greater extent, meaning that I could have £10,000 and I could spread that across 10 completely different properties with different tenants different tenants, um, such as residential, commercial, um, and everything in between. Uh, and with a buy to let investment, you're really putting all of your eggs into one basket. So how can you invest in this type of property? Well, with TAB, it's quite easy. First, you need to come to tabhq.com. And from there, you'll be able to register your interest and step by step take you through uh, personalizing your account, and taking a short investment quiz, as I said earlier, it's extremely important that you understand the risks involved when investing in anything, including property. We will take you through some AML and KYC checks, anti-money laundering and know your customer. And these are all done online with our third party um, verification software. And it takes just a few minutes uh, so that we can identify that you are who you say you are. And from then, you can start to invest directly into property investments and interestingly, short-term loan investments in the same place currently. 
once confirmed, we'll ask you to send us money and that will need to take place before any loan or property purchase can take place. So I wanted to tell you a bit about the lending side. TAB offers loans from six months to two years and the returns can be as high as 9% per annum. Again, this is the space that I have operated in for the last 15 years plus, and it's something TAB does extremely efficiently, and we're very proud of what we've done so far. To give you an idea um, of one of the lending products, so I'm going to pick the property on the left-hand side. Um, this is a loan product where we're lending on a first charge basis. This property is being purchased for £500,000 and TAB is making a loan of £325,000, being 65% of the value. This is a loan that would um, is being written for nine months, and the interest rate of 8.5% would be payable to investors on a monthly basis. And again, as described on the page before, you can invest in this property, um, in this loan, I should say, from just £1,000. And there are some other examples on the screen and at any time after this presentation we would be delighted to field any calls uh, or questions that you may have so a little bit more about the bridging rate products um, this we lend as a first charge on residential and commercial property and we do second charge loans as well on residential and commercial property um, loans start from about a hundred thousand pounds um, and I guess one of the skills of TAB is that we don't have extremely rigid criteria. Um, so it, it wouldn't be impossible for a loan to be slightly less than that. And £10 million is right at the top end of the type of loan size that we would do. To date, the largest loan we have completed is £6.9 million. Typically, our loan to values would not exceed 70%. And we lend to all types of borrowers, um, both onshore and offshore. So individuals, partnerships, limited companies, um, expats and offshore companies and trusts, and also pensions and some other interesting borrowers. So for borrowers, let me give you a little bit of insight into the types of loans that we do. Loans are from 100,000 to 10 million pounds, although typically we don't go that high on second charge loans. We do lend up to two years, which is slightly unusual, uh, and it's not completely impossible for us to lend even longer than that. And we lend to all different types of borrowers. So whatever your ownership structure is, whether it's an individual, a limited company, a offshore company, trust or otherwise, we are very focused on the types of assets that we're lending on. Um, and our rates start now from just 0.65% a month. And we would love to hear from you if you think we can help in any way. And if you want to contact us, um, I'm sure there'll be lots of opportunities to do so. I would urge you to have a quick look at tabhq.com where you can find lots of the information that I've talked to you about today and all of our contact details. And if you'd like to come and visit us, that's a thing to do these days as well. So we'd love to have you. Thank you very much for listening. Uh, I hope you found it useful and I hope you start to build your own diverse property portfolio soon. Thank you.